Hello, this is Alex Day, and you're watching Lily Sky. If you can notice, I am sunburnt because I went to Warp Tour yesterday. I will tell you my experience with Warp. We left around 11 because Jessica was running a little bit late, and we live in the city that Warp was in, so we figured like it wouldn't take long to get there. But unfortunately, it was designed very poorly, and it took forever to drive there. Traffic was horrible. We were going like zero, ne no, like negative 5,000 miles per hour. My dad dropped us off because we didn't want to pay for parking. So he dropped us off um, near the park, but not like right at it because it was taking forever. And unfortunately, the road that we were supposed to go on to walk there was blocked off. So we had to go all around and make a U-turn. So like we were here and the park was here. We had to go all around to get to the park. And I would say we walked about two or three miles. We ended up missing All Time Low set because, I mean, we wouldn't have made it anyway because of the traffic if we stayed in the car, but they played First Thing, which is stupid to me because it's like, they're one of the biggest bands playing there. So, and like every other, every other event Warped Tour so far, they've played like relatively late at night. And so I guess it was stupid for me to assume they would play late. Um, some guy tried to convert my friends to some weird religion. I swear he's there every Warped Tour. It's not the same guy, it's the same, like, organization. <laughs> And then we waited for the signing for like an hour. <laughs> the signing was okay. I mean, we didn't get to take pictures and they weren't even allowed to hug us. And I feel like Alex was kind of like iffy? I don't know. I, he was like really nice to other people when I got to meet he was so quiet and I was like why don't you love me? It was still good though. Um, Ryan wasn't there when I was kind of sad about that because I don't know I just feel like it's not complete without all of them there. Zach was actually the most talkative to me weirdly enough. Tell us what just happened with you. Oh my gosh I said I love you to Jack and he's like I love you too and then I was like I love Show us your poster. Then Jessica bought this like weird um, fizzy drink. Drink it. <laughs> it's so cool. I'm scared. And then I made them watch We Are the In Crowd because I knew Alex sang one song with them, um, Kiss Me Again, and I figured like since he's there and they're playing it, like he would come to their set and sing it. And he did, so I was happy. That made my day so much better, just like being able to hear him sing like a little bit of a song, even though I missed the set. Like, it was still good being able to see him perform, because honestly, Alex is one of my favorite. Like, All Time Low, they're so good on stage. Like, that's why I love them. <laughs>
pink hair is kind of funny. He kind of reminded me of Gabe Saporta for some reason when he was singing. Like, I don't know why, just like the way he was performing, I guess. But yeah, I enjoyed it immensely. Then we saw a little person dressed up as a garden gnome. Then we waited around until Yellow Card played. In this one song, there was like a re really cool like circle thing that they did around the warp tent. And then Ocean Avenue came on and I sang my heart out to it because that's like, I used to love that song and everyone knows the words of that song. Taking Back Sunday went on. They were so good. Like, oh my god. And especially because, like, everyone, like, had this energy from the crowd because, like, almost everyone in the crowd knew all their songs. I recorded a little bit of video for that, but, like, the sound was so intense that it I didn't really get good sound quality. <laughs> obviously because we wanted to hear Make Damn Sure, which was the last song. It was impossible to get out of the parking lot. It took us two hours to like move two inches. And so the guy that was driving us, he like drove off on the on this dirt path next to the road because other people started doing it. And actually it was a really good idea. We got out of there like in like 15 minutes doing that. And I'm sure other people were pissed. But <laughs> I wanted to go home. Like... It was already like 11.20 and I just wanted to sleep and I was sore and I'm obviously sunburned and I just wanted to leave. I might go next year. I mean it was just convenient this year because it was in the city I'm in and it was only 40 bucks and I wanted to see all time low even though I didn't really get to see them. But yeah, I have VidCon next week so I'll be making videos for that. Thanks for watching. Sorry I am grossly sunburned. Bye!